Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of Ark Survival Evolved on the Lost Island map. Today we are going out on Fulgrim and I am looking for an Anki. I have a trap set up over there that I can take one to and I'm just flying around over here on the mountains looking for one. I would also like to find a good herbivore to be able to gather up a bunch of berries. That's kind of my choke point right now, is getting enough berries to... Ooh. Getting enough berries to make narcotics. So we're just flying around the mountain looking to see if we can find... Well, anything really. Any, any high level Anki will be good enough for us. I have been flying around this mountain for like five minutes and I have yet to find a single Anki around here. I think I know why. Also, I found two 150 and like level 130 and a level 150 Alpha Raptor. Al two Alpha Raptors running side by side uh, around the top of that mountain just eating. Whoop, there's another one. Just eating anything that looked edible. I think I can take... Ah! You stupid raptors. You made me miss it. I was so close. There's raptors everywhere here. I found those two alpha raptors up there. And I don't think Fulgrim is... Is big and bad enough to take on two alpha raptors at the same time. That's a little worrisome. So, I'm just going to keep running around looking for an Anki. I wanted to get that gold drop... But, as you saw, I missed it. What are you? What am I looking at here? A Kintro. I kind of wish you could ride those. As it stands right now, there's no reason to really ever, ever tame them on a single player map. And that one's got some decent colors. So, looking around, I definitely want to put a... Uh, refinery little base area right over there but because there's metal all over this mountain here but there's no point in building anything if I can't find you know an Anki to take advantage of all this metal where are they here's the pack of uh, alpha raptors running around one of them is a level 50. And maybe... Maybe, just maybe, I'm tough enough to take the 50 down. But I need stamina before I do that. Okay, stamina and heal up before I take that on. There's also an egg here on the ground. Is that a... No, it's not an egg. It's a, it's a pack. Ooh! Woo! Somebody is hitting me for 200 damage. It's that 150, 130 or 150 alpha here. These things. Woo! I can kill one of them. But I don't know that I can get both of them. I gotta be careful. I don't wanna... If I can kill one of them and get the, the food boost, I'll be okay. And it's this one over here that I think I can kill. But I gotta be careful with how often I let them hit me. I do not want to lose Fulgrim. This is my baby. If I lose Fulgrim, I am done with the game, I think. Come on. You're a pretty raptor. I like the color on you. You got all these blues. He's got a blue feather scheme on his back, which I like. But uh, I hate raptors. I hate them so much. And there's two saber tooths over there as well. A 140 female and his mate boosted, so the other one's a male. An 85 male. That might be worth looking at they actually might be worth going to, to try to tame up 
if I could build myself a well a trap for them over here. Where did those raptors go? Pluto digs. Excuse me, Alpha Raptors, where did you go? I want the experience for you. Or at least I want the experience for one of you. Where did they go to? There's three. Three saber tooths over here. Female 140. The other one's underneath me. There's a female 140. What else do we have? Don't land on the ground, please. I keep looking at that stupid female. Where'd the others go? I hate. Sometimes I get so lost. There's an 85 male. And what are you? Another female 140. So two 140 females and an 85 male. That's interesting. Do I try to do something with them? I've got myself a little pin set up. Let's see if we can grab maybe this 140 female. Where were they? I think they were around here. Let's see if we can grab this 140 female. If I can remember where they were. And try to tame them up. I am going to need more Trank darts. I only have nine. And I'm going to need like... I would say probably 20. Oh, don't die to the RG. Don't die to the RGs, please. Let's take the RGs off of them. Or let's try to kill the RGs. Looks like maybe one of them died. Oh no. Did it get did they get both of them? Is there anything? Did they get both of my saber tooths? Are you serious? Did all of you die? Or is that one of you down there? I can't see over Fulgrim's neck. There is something down there at the bottom of the mountain. But I... Ho, 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 ho. Ho, ho, ho. Wrong button. Wrong button. Just about died. Oh my god. Did I lose three max level tames? Or nearly max level tames in a row like that? Are you joking? Ugh. I, I do not believe all three of them died. Uh, there's... Here's a Sabretooth. Are you the one that I want? I don't know. You don't look like any of them that I remember. And it's not dealing too much damage to me. So it's probably not the one that I want. But let's get it over to the trap either way. And figure out what level this big guy is. Are you the 85 male? Because I don't really want just the 85 male. I don't even know why I'm taming a saber tooth to be honest. They're not that great, but they're good for caves. If I don't get a berry. He's a little damaged. And Fulgrim's taking a beating here. Took a little bit of a beating there. What are you? 140 female. Okay. Okay, so let's work on 
taming this girl up here. What do I need for her? A dodo dex, please fill me in. I would need 30 crossbow bolts or 22 tranquilizer darts. And what do I have? Not enough of either. So I will come back when I can tame this one. It looks like we got a little lucky here. I was looking for an herbivore to be able to go through and get a bunch of berries. And just right outside the rookery here, I found a trike. Now, it's a 145. And I have just enough. I have just enough. Oh, if I don't die. Oh, oh no, don't die. I have just enough. Uh, uh, what am I? Oh, I'm sorry. I am so concentrated on not dying here. I have. Ooh, you're in. Okay. Come on. Go in. Go in. Go into the... Ah. I wanted to go into the trap. But it looks like I'm about to die. Get on. Come on. I needed to go in the trap. I have just enough trank arrows to trank it if I can get it to go in here. There we go. Whew. Oh, oh, oh no. Oh no. Did my trap break? Or did you just go over top of it? What happened? What just happened there? Okay. I want to try pranking her. I need 22 and I had just enough to do it. Eventually she should start running away pretty soon. Hopefully before my stairs break but if i could get this 145 trike then i have all of the berries i'll ever need and if this fails i'm gonna have to like go tame up a bronto or something which i have never done i've been playing arc since scorched earth came out and i don't think i've ever tamed a bronto even when you needed bronto kibble right so, let's see if I can get this this girl to go down. Hopefully my stairs make it just a little bit longer. Give me seven more shots, please. If not, I'll go sit on Fulgrim's back. And he should be able to tank a hit or two while I switch over to uh, Narc Arrows. And come on! Go down. Go down. Is there... Is that a Pego? Stupid Pego. Uh, give me my Narc Arrows. Uh, I've put quite a lot of shots into her. She should be about to go to sleep anytime. I'm saying a her. I don't know if it's a her. I didn't check that close. I think it's a female. Go down. Or stay concentrated on my wall. Don't hit me, don't hit me, don't hit me, don't hit me. Go down. You know you want to go to sleep. Go to sleep. Don't go to sleep in the water. Don't go to sleep in the water, please. Down. Okay. Okay. Let's make sure there are no raptors around. Get some medjo berries off of Speedy over here and get this get this girl tamed up uh medjos thank you speedy i don't even know why i built that gate i never come in and out of it i just fly over it every time 
it's nice to be able to get uh, some more Love Evolved colors, even though I am playing this after the event has already ended. Uh, I couldn't play... You know, the event was only up for like four or five days, right? So I couldn't play the entire time. But we'll be taming this girl up, and we're still smelting down a bunch of metal to tame up our Cybertooth over there, way down over there. And yeah, that's... This is really what I wanted to get done today, but I need an Anki also. I really, really, really need an Anki. Our trike woke up. It didn't take all that long. Just about five minutes or so. Look at how pretty you are. And let's rename you. Uh, change name. You are going to be... You're a female, right? Sarah, female. Okay, good. Good, good, good. Look at how pretty you are. Look at you. Let's. I already crafted up a saddle for her. Let's throw it on. And we'll come through here and we'll murder any bushes that we see. And try to get as many narco berries as possible. And we go through. We get narcos just a little bit faster than Speedy does. So, I wish I was somewhere with a little bit more ground cover. But we had to make do with what we got, so we will. I'll throw all this wood and thatch off. Because I don't need it. So, wait, 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 wait. Drop the thatch, thatch. We'll take the narco. Transfer that over. And then we'll just drop all the Tinto. Drop all that. And that should give us enough weight to make it back home pretty easily. Cool. So we got a bunch of Narco Berries. Uh, and we have a way to get Narco Berries quickly if we ever need more. Now, the next thing I'm going to do, I guess, is make up a bunch of Trank Darts to go over there and tame up all of those Sabertooths that we saw. I should probably also make a Sabertooth Saddle, but I have my Cryopod, so I probably don't need the Sabertooth Saddle. I'll just bring it over here and drop it off. The Rookery's getting a little, uh, <laughs> a little full. There's quite a lot of dinos in there for such a small pin. This is not meant to be my final base, but I am pretty lazy <laughs> when it comes to building an arc. I am pretty lazy and I don't like moving around all that much just because it's a huge pain. It's such a pain in the butt to move around in this game. I've got a ton of metal smelting down. I need to transfer all of these over and just craft up 66. Uh, that's not that many trank darts. And I need some wood. I know Sarah's got some wood, so we'll grab that off of her. How's my water? My water's fine. My water's doing fine. I'll probably take the... Probably going to take the... Uh, you know Drop you. Don't need you. The water skin out of my inventory and keep kiting there in case I fun run across a sign of macrops. That's... I'm so excited for those sign of macropses. Split half. White fire. And I know I'm wasting wood here because there's not that much metal in that smeltery. But I'm also here for the charcoal, right? So I need I need a ton of charcoal in order to make gunpowder. So I'm not really worried about wasting wasting wood. It's a renewable resource. No, it doesn't matter at all. Ooh, go ahead and craft up. 12 bullets, and I need narcotics in order to make more trank darts. So I'll get started on this. I've probably said this before, but the thing, one of the things I dislike a lot about this map is the constant smoky weather effect. This is like, I, I don't get very often to play, so I only get to play and record on Saturdays because of my, my real life job as a teacher. But I am constantly, like, I see this, like, pretty much the entire time I'm playing, I feel like. I do have enough Trank Darts to come over here and tame up our Sabertooth. 
So I am on my way over there to pick her up. And while I'm on my way over there, I need to think of, I don't know, a nice sort of name for her, I guess. I don't know what I'm going to call this one, but I'll think of something by the time I get there. And we made it all the way over here. She's still in the trap. Fulgrim's eating and making terrible noises. Let's hope she doesn't bug out and glitch out of there. Hold still, please. I want to shoot you in the head. It should only take about eight of these if I get headshots, right? So, uh, But getting the headshots, that's going to be the hard part. Please don't be crazy. Give me headshots. Thank you. I don't want to kill her. A 140 female Sabretooth isn't bad. I don't know what I would be using the Sabretooth for. I don't know why I want a breeding pair of Sabretooths. Uh, I don't know. I just kind of want to have some off-meta dinos for this run. I say that as I have a bright purple Argent right over there. And I do fully plan on going and getting a griffin and going to get some wyverns. But whatever, that doesn't matter. <laughs> that doesn't matter. What we need now is some prime meat to fill her belly up. So where can I find something juicy to kill for some prime meat? I also would like to find an Anki while I'm over here, game. Just, just letting you know, I'm looking for one of those. What can I murder? I have a lot of regular meat. Speaking of, ah, I missed it. I was, darn it, I was trying to pay attention to get a whole bunch of that to spoil at once. I should have paid better attention than I was. If I don't see anything really close by that has some prime meat, then I'll just feed her the raw meat and go on with my life and not worry too much about it. But, you know, I would rather get Aha, here we go. Nice walking prime meat if you're not a crazy high level. And you're only hitting me for 41? Fine, whatever. I'll kill you. You'll die. Nice and quick. Not even a threat to my bird. Oh, he was 150. Maybe I should have paid more attention. Did we get... Did we get Prime? We sure did. Let's go tame up our Sabretooth. Our cat is just about to wake up. Almost there. Just one more bite. Come on, cat. Take a bite. Yeah, it only took three Prime meat to get it up here. Maybe my taming rates are too high. Maybe I should turn it down a little bit. Just a little bit. And I think... I'm going to name her Mittens because she has like different colored paws. So that's what we're going to go with. As soon as she wakes up here, we'll get her tamed up. Come on. You're so close. It should be. Wow. Okay. Fulgrim, I've just been sitting here staring at Fulgrim and well, not as he's doing that. Yeah. Here, I've just been sitting here staring at Fulgrim as he basks majestically majestically in the sunlight here. I love my bird. Look at you. So beautiful. I always end up with like white or gray Argies. Whoop, there we go. Mittens. Mittens, you're our first saber tooth. And you are going right inside of the cryopod. And then I'll look and see if I can get maybe another one. That other female that's up there. I'll think about it. I'll think about it. Well, I have looked all over this mountain for our other saber tooths, And all I'm finding are Rexes and Carnos. I didn't find... I have yet to find our other saber tooth. There's a bunch of Stegos over here. And there is one Anki, but it's level 15, and I don't really want just a level 15 Anki <clears throat> that has, like, no weight whatsoever. 
that's not really worth it. So, I don't know. I guess I'm going to give up on getting that breeding pair of of Sabertooths. There was that 85 male and another 140 female. But, I don't know. I guess those Stegos that we saw the last time we were up here, they must have killed them. Because I don't see them anywhere. There is another Alpha Raptor there. Wow, that's like... No, that's one of those original Alpha Raptors. Okay, the ones that were just destroying me. Well, I guess we are going to take our Sabertooth and head back home. I didn't find the Anki that I wanted to find. I didn't find the extra Sabertooth that I wanted to find. But getting one saber tooth, that's fine. And then we got plenty of metal. I've got like three, three, four hundred metal melting up back home right now. Uh, and I can always come back here later and murder a bunch of things to get uh, an Anki to spawn. So I think we'll head back home now. I got all the way home and I realized I remembered last episode we found that uh valentine's colored saber tooth over here and i'm pretty sure it was a high level male let's kill this rg before it becomes a problem pretty sure it was a high level male and i don't remember Ooh, i got a metal pick i don't remember if it was still alive or if it had gotten murdered by this rex and I don't remember what level this Rex is, so maybe I just made a big mistake. I'm hoping that that male is still alive over here. Yeah, I hear you. I don't think he can. Don't think he can get up here and punch us. So, as ah, level 55, he's not gonna be a big problem. Oh, he could make it up here. I'm a little bit surprised. We'll just murder him. Collect his arms. And look around for that saber tooth. Hopefully he's still alive. If he is, I'm going to tame him up. This wreck should give us some prime meat to do that with. Yeah, seven prime meat. Looking around. I see this special color dodic is still alive which makes me believe that our good buddy the saber tooth is not alive uh, 45 i might tame him up just to have a special colored one but i'm going to look around here and see if i can find him i had a good name for him i'm hoping he's still running around and if not i'll just come back I have taken a good look around and I didn't find our buddy the Sabertooth, but I did find T-Rex number 20 for this playthrough so far. And there's a pack of aloes right there. Just right there. And I would like to remind everybody that, oh, a 130 aloe, if at that. I would like to remind everybody that this is the beach that I spawned on. I spawned right here. Right where that trike is. How are there so many monstrous carnivores right here? I was hoping that our buddy the Sabertooth was still around, but I... I did fly around, look in a lot of places, like, I took a nice low fly through here. Sabertooths are kind of small, uh, so they can be a little hard to spot. There's a hyena don. They could be a little difficult to spot because they're so tiny sometimes, but this guy was like purple and pink and orange. I don't think I'd have this much trouble finding him in all of these mountains. Is that a Stego or is that a Kintro? That's a Kintro, right? Yeah. Again, I really wish we could ride Kintros. I know... The whole point is because of their back, you're not supposed to ride them with their huge spikes. 
Oh, there's another Rex. Uh, Rex 21 for the playthrough. Uh, this is Rex Mountain. That's what I'm going to call this. Uh, I have not seen our buddy, though, so I'm pretty much just going to give up on him. I might take another two minutes here to, to make another couple of passes after I kill this guy, but... Will a, will a Rex aggro on a Sabretooth? I think so. I'm pretty sure I've seen a bunch of Rexes eating a Sabretooth alive before. Level 45 Rex, you're useless. Yeah, I don't think... I don't have a lot of high hopes. I'll travel a little bit further, but I think he's gone. Well, everybody, I looked around for a little while, but I was unable to find Mittens a mate. But that's okay. She'll still be our buddy and go out and collect a bunch of hide for us. One thing I do want to say before I end this episode is that the ARC videos might slow down quite a bit. Uh, I'm very busy the next couple of weeks at work, and they might slow down to just one video a week for ARC, because these videos do take a long time to prepare and get ready, because there's just so much that you have to do that's really boring off-camera. But, whatever. As always, if you like this episode, please leave me a like. Thank you, Sarah. If you didn't like this episode, feel free to leave me a dislike. Comments, they're always appreciated. This has been SCG Sheep, and as always, I will see you in the next episode. Goodbye.